The Islamic Republic of Iran Army conducted its first ever multi branch U of exercise on August 24, according to a report on the Islamic Republic of Iran news network, Iron. The drill included 150 drones from four branches of the army, and the report included footage from the Army Zoo of Base 313, which houses more than 100 drones, according to a report issued by memory. It also highlighted the operations of the Cayman 12 and Cayman 22 reconnaissance drones, monitoring stations in the Anark area, and the Ahmed suicide drone, which contrasted with Azerbaijan's deployment of the Israeli-made Harup drone. According to Gen. Hamid Behedi, commander of the Army's Air Force, the drones are outfitted with missiles and bombs manufactured by Iran's Ministry of Defense. The next day, Channel 1, Iran, aired a report on the drill. The Channel 1 reporter said, On the second day of the Army's joint UAV exercise, the Iranian skies, from south to north and from east to west, are controlled by at least 150 state-of-the-art and diverse UAVs. Meanwhile, according to a report by the AP, Ukraine's military said for the first time on Tuesday that it came across an Iranian-supplied suicide drone used by Russia on the battlefield. The first large drone combat exercise of the Army of the Islamic Republic of Iran began with the participation of hundreds of UAVs from the four forces of the army in the general area of Semnan, north of the country. According to the Army Information Base, Deputy Commander for Operations of the Islamic Republic of Iran, on Tuesday, Rear Admiral Said Mohammad Massavi explained the various dimensions of the large drone combat exercise, said that Iran is one of the world's most powerful countries in the field of drones. Army UAV combat Different types of UAV systems in Army, Air Defense, Air, and Naval Defense will perform determined missions in real combat conditions. The Deputy Chief of Operations of the Islamic Republic of Iran stated, the implementation of drone combat operations, including air interception and destruction of air targets using air-to-air -air missiles, destruction of ground targets using bombs and high-precision guided missiles, as well as the widespread use of suicide drones, or kamikaze drones, are among the measures in the operational section of this exercise which is going to be performed. Rear Admiral Massavi added, the flight of UAVs of the Navy of the Army of the Islamic Republic of Iran from vessels in the southern waters of the country, the long-range flight of suicide drones to destroy critical targets in the depths of enemy territory will be drone among combat training plans. According to Rear Admiral Massavi, the participation of drone units involved in the exercise from other parts of the country, as well as the monitoring of land, air, and sea borders are other important measures of this large drone combat exercise. The mission kicked off from different parts of Iran, from the warm waters of the Persian Gulf and the Oman Sea in the south to the east, west, north and center of the country and border areas. The Islamic Republic of Iran Army has started a large-scale drone drill, which features scores of cutting-edge reconnaissance and combat drones, and covers strategic waters of the Persian Gulf and the Sea of Oman, all four corners of the country and its central part. Vice Admiral Mohammad Massavi, Deputy of Army Operations and spokesman for the Army's 1401 Joint Drone Exercise, said on Wednesday that surveillance drones operated by the four units of the Army, namely the Ground Force, Navy, Air Force and Air Defense Force, successfully carried out their intelligence gathering and patrol missions on the first day of the two-day drill.
The 1401 Joint Drone Drill kicked off on Wednesday in the presence of the four branches of the Army and the Joint Defense Base in the north, south, west, and center of Iran. The two-day exercise will be conducted with 150 surveillance and reconnaissance and combat drones in the north, south, west, and center of Iran. According to Iran Press News Agency, Coordinating Deputy of the Islamic Republic of Iran Army and the commander of the 1401 Joint Drone Drill of the Army, Rear Admiral Habibullah Sayyari, said, Today, the drones are a new phenomenon. Recently, the effectiveness of them in the crisis has been proven, such as in the war between the Republic of Azerbaijan and Armenia in Karabakh, the war between Ukraine and Russia, etc. The Islamic Republic of Iran is not dependent on other countries to provide security, and all the equipment in the field of UAVs is produced domestically, Rear Admiral Siyari noted. The commander of the 1401 Joint Drone Drill of the Islamic Republic of Iran Army stated that having a UAV capability contributes to the deterrence of the country and emphasized, the security of the country and the region must be provided by the countries of the region.